Scotland to me brings so much to the film in that it's um, it's this incredibly beautifully rugged country and the people are really spunky and, and tough and so there's a character to Scotland that you don't find in a lot of the other countries I find but just visually it's it's um, rocky and hard and harsh but yet the the weather is kind of tropical in a sense it's always wet so there's always something growing on everything these big just pillows of, of lichen and moss and everything and so it softens the whole place so you you've got this contrast of rugged and soft and it, it feels I've I've, um, I've always said that Scotland feels like a woman to me she there it's it's um, soft on the on the top but it's made of tougher stuff underneath Merida is everything that's passionate and stubborn and um, uh, willful and charming and funny and everything great about all of the negative and everything negative about all of the great you know <laughs> she she just is who she is and she has a strong sense of self the look of the world is that um, rugged Scotland. I didn't want to, um, you know, do an extra polished castle and, and pristine, you know, we've seen that and it's beautiful and Sleeping Beauty and, and those kind of things. But I wanted a really earthy sense, you know, we're, we're, we're building up a folk tale here and I wanted to feel folksy, you know, just sort of rugged. And I remember my um, production designer, Steve Pilcher, asked me what I wanted to feel, you know, what, how would I describe this castle when I looked at it, and I, I couldn't think of a word, so I just went, <clears throat> you know, <laughs> I was like, Ugh! and it just, it just, that's what it needed to, just from the earth.